Lisa attended both of our summer institutes for educators and spent um, several weeks learning about sustainable energy research on campus and came away with some really great ideas to bring um, sustainable energy activities back to her classroom, including building um, wind turbines, solar ovens, and some great, really great hands-on activities to engage her, her, her unique learners. I just, I'm, I'm appreciative and very grateful that I was able to, to attend both the institutes. Um, like I said, I, I had no idea what I was going into this, this fall with my, my, with my science curriculum. I really, none. Um, and we attended that and I came home going, oh, I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this and this and this. And we're going to start out with, you know, what is energy and go through the different types. Our main goal is it's to keep the <laughs> Okay, go to work, guys. Okay, we, do you remember the design we had? Yes. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, that's why I can uh, do that. Hold it. Flat, like, right there. Well, yes, I'm plugging it. I can't wait to finish this application. First and foremost, I appreciate something that has true value. Um, you know, for my kids to learn um, this is in the animal kingdom and this is in this and, you know, all those terms that most of them aren't going to use in their daily lives. This is something that they can grasp. It's a concept they're actually going to use in their life. Um, to me, that's far more important than for formulas or, you know, memorizing the cell parts and whatnot. For my students, that's what is important. Through these lessons, I'm finding skills that some of my students have that I didn't realize they had. Um, for instance, um, I have a one, one student, the oldest student in my group, who has, um, is very gifted artistically. And um, when he did his solar oven, he sat with his Chromebook with a YouTube video on the design that he wanted to use. And he would stop the YouTube video and then he would do that part of it very systematically back and forth. And it was just, it was very fascinating to watch him because that's not how I work, that's not how I process things. And so to see him in action was kind of eye-opening for me. Um, it, it, you know, made me realize that, oh, you know, I don't always get how they're understanding things. And I, I'm, I'm glad that, you know, some of them are retaining those facts because that's, that's why I'm doing it.